Hailey Bieber, along with millions of other admirers, recently shared a post about Beyoncé's rendition of Dolly Parton's Jolene. However, others believe Bieber made a slight on Selena Gomez in the process. What is now known about the issue is as follows. Cowboy Carter, Beyoncé's debut country album, was released today to very positive reviews, as you've probably already heard. Beyoncé's unique rendition of Parton's beloved ballad, Message to the Other Woman, may be heard on the album. While Dolly pleaded with Jolene not to take her boyfriend, Beyoncé advises the sidekick to keep things going. Like a few other songs from Beyoncé's Lemonade album, this one is sure to become an anthem for everyone who has had to deal with an unfaithful lover. Fans are therefore taking Haley's decision to upload the song on her profile very seriously. It's significant to note that Haley did not address Selena or her spouse, Justin Bieber. She only captioned the song on social media with the words, Phew. As previously mentioned, Beyoncé's, Jolene, is currently the most popular song in the world, so none of that is particularly noteworthy. However, because of the ongoing internet obsession with the long-rumored Selena Haley spat, practically everything Haley posts is scrutinized for indications of racism. The allegations of problems in Haley and Justin's marriage have made the issue worse than it has ever been. Therefore, it shouldn't be shocking that Haley's message has been misconstrued so much. On this one, though, the haters are reaching out like never before. Online chatter claimed HB's upload proves she was jealous and obsessed with Selena, as TMZ reported. To put it nicely, the website continued by saying that the rumors are a bit of a stretch if we're being honest. Naturally, Selena has not yet responded to the matter in the public eye. To be honest, we really hope that she is blissfully oblivious that weirdos on social media are attempting to drag her into a conflict with Haley once more. Beyoncé has more significant endeavors going on, as evidenced by the release of the year's biggest album. Hopefully, she's organizing a world tour this weekend.